Big 7 Week on Quad Cities Live is sponsored by Fleet Feet. The Bix is made up of seven grueling miles, but runners find themselves achieving what they never thought they could because of the crowd cheering them on, and that includes the entertainers on the sidelines putting smiles on our faces. PJ Scott and Chris Delson are the Bix Entertainment co-chairs, and they are joining me now. Uh, thank you both for being here today. Thank you, Maureen. Thanks. Yes, this is such a fun topic uh, to discuss. <laughs> All of these different elements uh, coming together with the Bix, it's just been really fun, I think, not only for me, but I think for our audience to just kind of see the ins and outs of all of it. So Chris, um, let's actually start with the party before the race. Um, so tomorrow night, Brady Street Sprints, there's actually some um, live music that's going to be happening in celebration of that before and after that event. Yeah, down at the MLK Center, yeah. they are hosting this um, a party, a pre-party before and that will take a pause while the sprint's happening. And then there's a party with a live band afterwards uh, that goes till, I believe it's from eight to nine, I think is what it is. Yeah. And it's, it's a way to show off uh, that new space that's so fantastic to have in our community. Absolutely, we're talking about the new MLK Park that was just uh, completed not too long ago. It's a great amenity to have uh, in the Hilltop area. Exactly. Um, so that'll be a lot of fun for, for folks to check out. We know the Brady Street Sprints, uh, we get more and more spectators every year because yeah. it is so fun to watch. Yep, it is. Okay, so PJ, on Saturday, there's gonna be music all along the seven mile route, but also the Quick Bix route. Yes, absolutely. So. You know, between the, the Quad City Times Bix 7 mm -hmm. and the Prairie Farms Quick Bix, uh, I counted just today, we've got over 30 acts wow. that will be out along the course and among the runners on the course. Mm -hmm. That is 30 acts. Yeah. <laughs> I, you guys have been busy. A little <laughs> bit, yeah, yeah. <laughs> a little bit busy. Um, Chris, talk about the different genres of music. Uh, you, uh, in an email, you listed a few of them, but they, they definitely vary. We have the Quad City Ukulele Club is playing at their regular spot on Kirkwood. Um, they always... I love that. They've they got always, a spot. They do. They always have so much fun with it, too. The interaction that happens with it, yeah. too. Um, we, uh, Josh Duffy's playing with his group on the Quick Bix route. We've got... Um, We've got a polka band, the Music Krauts. We're excited to have them for the first year. Um, we've got the Marylands. We've got nine Marylands, I believe. And then eight or seven or eight Elvi. Elvi? Yeah, right? Yeah. Is that the plural of Elvis? I think so, Elvis's yeah. Elvis's Elvi. Elvi, yeah, yeah. I love that. Okay, so you guys have covered it all. Um, why, Chris, though, it, do you feel like it's so important to have that variety? Uh, I think um, as runners, we... I would. Well, let me start. I was talking with someone yesterday, and he's like, I used to run with, like, music, and, and then it's just, like, boring, right? right? And then when you, like, have to take away your earbuds and there's nothing going on, it's, like, even more boring. Yeah, it's a little scary. Right. So then, as we all know, like, having live music and that live it's like a heartbeat or a rhythm that goes, that helps you keep going. Mm -hmm. It's important to help us runners, and we like the cheering, and we yes. like the, the excitement that's happening. It's a party atmosphere yeah. that with it, it only intensifies with music. I would completely agree yeah, yeah. with you. Yesterday Absolutely. I spoke to Gary Fisher, who has, uh, is about to run his 50th Bix. Mm. He is one of the few that has run every single one of them. And he said during those first years that um, you know he was running with another guy, I, I think another one that has run 50 Bixes, and it was like quiet. And, you know, because mm -hmm. it was the first few years, yeah. and and they go to the people on the sidelines. Come on, give us a clap or something like. Right. It just reminds me of that. So yeah. Um, so yeah, that's super important. Having Bix uh, music along the Bix route, and that includes, as you alluded to, the quick Bix route. Um, you know, sometimes we feel like you know there's so much um, excitement over that seven mile race that we forget that people are really achieving things mm -hmm. on that Absolutely. two mile portion. Yeah. It is still not easy to run up <laughs> Brady Street Hill, and when you are running back down to finish up the quick fix a little music couldn't hurt that's right <laughs> absolutely so how did you guys uh, find these different um, musical performers or bands um, because 30 is a lot it is it is and I, I you know to some extent we have uh, a bit of a database that kind of nice. continues like to the build. ukulele yeah, yeah. exactly <laughs> there are groups that have been playing for spot, years right? yeah uh, mm -hmm. And then, you know, we, we put out and we worked with Common Chord oh, uh, nice. to help get the word out to, hey, if, if you know of a band that you want to see on the course, mm -hmm. give us their info. And, you know, we try and work through that to, you know, keep those established groups, but also expand that every year. That's yeah. nice. Yeah, it's kind of a fine line where you want to invite um, some new folks in and, and also yeah. keep the ones that we love to see. Right. Um, this is also a huge opportunity for these bands and musicians, because let's face it, there's a lot of people that are going to be watching them. Yeah. 
Very much so. Yeah, they I get, mean, yeah. Like thousands. Yeah, it's yeah, thousands of runners, and you get free exposure yes. to these people, and it's a wide variety. Yeah. Polka, country. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's it's incredible. There's a lot there. <laughs> okay, so um, and if people are interested um, in the future on maybe being a part of the music of the Bix, I mean, I feel like as soon as you're done with this year's Bix, you start planning for for next year's Bix. We do. We do spend a lot of time thinking about it. Yeah. 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 You're not yeah. far off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or if okay. you want to host a party, host a band, we got gotcha. you. Oh, that's yeah. wonderful. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. very cool. Okay, great. Well, uh, if the idea of music along the race route has you ready to register for the Bix, you still can. Just visit Bix7.com. Chris and PJ, well done. Uh, great job on this whole thing, and it, it sounds like it's going to be a lot of fun. Thank we you. We certainly Everyone hope so. involved, yeah. yes. Well, my